Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to download the Pokemon Go spoofer onto your device. This is an insane modded version of Pokemon Go, and it gives you a joystick, all these settings. I'm going to open it up and show you guys, but the best part about this is there's no money involved, there's no jailbreak, there's no computer. So as you guys can see right here, I have this bar on the right side of the screen. This will show me all the Pokemon closest to me. I have my joystick, which means I can literally walk around the Pokemon world from my house. You also get a bar that will show you all of these settings. I'll show you guys that in a minute. So as you can see right now, I'm actually being like, it's actually thinking that I'm walking when I move the joystick. So this is real guys. You do not have to leave your house. You can travel anywhere in the world. So see this green Pokeball here on the left, you press on that. You can go to these hotspots. These are top locations in the Pokemon world. And I can actually just go ahead and teleport to these. So I just press teleport and the game actually takes me to this place and I'm able to interact and catch the Pokemon in these areas as well as interact with the gyms and the Pokestop. So it's pretty crazy, guys. I can't even believe it actually works, but it does. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how to download this onto your device. It's super awesome. And uh, there's also Enhanced Throw, which gives you 100% catch rate on the Pokemon. And you guys can see some of them are starting to pop up. So I'm going to show you guys how to download it. So if you're using an iPhone, there are some settings we need to change to better prepare the device. First up, make sure Portrait Orientation Lock is turned on. Once you've done that, guys, all you have to do is go to Settings. And there's a few different options we're going to go ahead and change. So let me just go to settings right here. So once you're in settings, guys, the first thing you're going to do is go down and you want to go to general. So let me just show you guys right here and make sure that the background app refresh is turned on. This allows apps to go ahead and refresh content in the background. So it's pretty important. You can have it on Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi mobile data. It does not matter, guys, but make sure it is turned on to one of those and you're going to be all set. So once you've done that, guys, all you have to do is go ahead and go back and you want to go to where it says battery. So let me just go back here. So I'm just going to keep going back. All right, and you want to go down to where it says battery and make sure, guys, in the battery section that the low power mode is turned off. You know it's on because your battery percentage is going to be yellow, so make sure low power mode is turned off. All right, so once you've done that, guys, all you have to do is go to App Store and make sure automatic downloads is turned on. And also make sure the automatic downloads is set to always allow. So once you've done that, guys, make sure in the Android phone that the power saving mode is off. And then also make sure the auto rotate screen is on. So once you've done all this, guys, you're good to go. So all you have to do now is go ahead and go to this amazing site. So let me just go to my browser and I'm going to show you guys where you need to go. So let me just go to Safari and I'm going to go ahead and type it in. So this is the site where we can download it. It has a bunch of monster apps and games. It's pretty cool. So I'm just going to go ahead and type it in. All right. So once you're on the site, guys, what you want to do is go to the search bar and just type Pokemon Go. Now you will see a lot of ways to do it. You got a search bar. You can just scroll around, but I think search bar is best. So I'm going to type Pokemon Go. It's going to come up. You want to find the one called Pokemon Go Plus Plus. So just press on it, guys. And once you do that, you're going to see a button that says Start Injection. So let me just show you guys this right here. So you see Start Injection. You press on this. It's going to download. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely try it out for yourself. Get the word out about this method. I'm blown away. It actually works, guys. But it does. Super, super cool. This is an amazing trick. Awesome stuff. I mean, you guys got to try this one out, guys. It's so amazing. Um, so you just wait until the bar reaches that amount downloading it. I already have it, but obviously you guys will. So definitely give it a try guys. Everyone needs to know about this. It's so amazing and uh, it's super awesome. So yeah, guys, really cool stuff. Um, I really like this because I've been able to get so many Pokemon cause I mean, there's only like five in my town, but I can actually use Pokemon go spoofer and I can go anywhere I want. So that really just ups it up. And you really just spend more time playing Pokemon Go because you can catch more Pokemon. So it's pretty insane, guys. I love Enhanced Throw as well because you throw the ball right, you catch each Pokemon on the first try, which is insane. And that wasn't happening to me when I played normal Pokemon Go, let me tell you. So yeah, super awesome, guys. Definitely give it a shot. Get the word out about this method. And you guys can see there's so many Pokemon here. So let's try to catch this one right here. All right. And uh, I don't know if it's going to work, but I'm going to try and throw the ball right. And yeah, so I'm going to see you later and peace out.